Hi, Terry Van Noy. Welcome to Math Class with Terry V. Hope this video helps you out, and if you enjoy it, please share it, comment, or like it. And you can also go to my website, mathpowerline.com. It's a math resource blog, uh, lesson videos for students, and other resources for parents and teachers. Give me a call, or go to my website or email. All right, let's go to today's lesson. All right, try the following two problems where you solve for x. Keep in mind the kinds of triangles you see here and see what you can figure out. Hit pause and give it a shot. All right, let's see how you did. First of all, you know that because this side is 20 and this side is 20, that is an isosceles triangle. And we had a theorem that said the base angles are congruent. That means that this angle up here needs to also be 2x plus 11. We have three angles there that add up to 180 degrees. 2x plus 11 plus 2x plus 11 plus x minus 2 equals 180. Again, hit pause if you haven't gotten this far and try the work. Let's solve for x. 2x plus 2x plus x is 5x. 11 plus 11, take away 2, is 20. 5x plus 20 equals 180. Subtract 20 from each side. You have 5x equals 160. Divide each side by 5. x equals 32. For problem number 11, we have to remember that we have some vertical angles. If that angle right there is 30 degrees, this angle also has to be 30 degrees, which makes this triangle a triangle that has a 40 degree angle in it, a 30 degree angle in it, and we should be able to figure out what that angle is right there. 40 plus 30 is 70, subtract from 180, 110. Now, we know that 110 degrees plus this angle here must equal 180 because that is a straight angle. Therefore, that angle must be 70 degrees. Now we have a large triangle that has three angles, of course. We know a 70 degree angle, we know an 80 degree angle, and we should be able to figure out what the x angle is. Did you figure it out? 70 plus 80 is 150, therefore x must be 30 degrees. Congratulations, good job. All right, there you have it. I invite you to go to my website now, mathpowerline.com, or email me or give me a call. The way I work best with students is live online in my classroom. So if I can help you in any way, answer some specific questions, the first lesson with me is free as I show you how everything works. All right, study hard and take care.